those tree sweets look delicious. I can't wait for them to fall from the trees. You won't have to wait another moment, Tria. Not while I'm around. For you, Tria. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Topsy. Ugh, grown ups. <laughs> you see, Sarah? Three horns can do anything they set their mind to, and be the best at it, too. All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Come fall on me. Hills to climb and valleys to roam. Oh, streams to follow all the way home. To the land before time. Of course I do, Sarah. Now, Topsy. <laughs> well, I'm glad someone believes me. I wish it were true. It is true, Sarah. You're a three horn, so be proud. We're the best among the crowd. And you know that we can do. What we set our minds to do anything. Listen while I sing. You can do anything if you just watch me. You will agree. Trees are no match for my leg. Watch this rock crack like an egg. My horn slice, and yes, there's more. I can really roar, do anything. Come and join me, sing. We, we can, can do, do anything. anything. Three horns are the best. Put us to the test. We'll do anything. <laughs> <laughs> You see, Sarah? I do now. Three horns really can do anything. Look, everybody, I have a new trick. I call it log running. If you watch carefully, you can do it too. First, you get on the log. This is the hard part. <laughs> then, you stand up. This is the harder part. Do not fall off. The harder 
scariest part is next. Now, you start running on top of the log. The faster, the better. Now I am going faster and faster. Go, go, go! Whoa, that looks like fun. Log running is fun. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> and it is very easy to learn. I can show you how to do it. I can. Hey, I'll give it a try, Ducky. So what if I get a little wet? Move over. I'm going to try, too. Come on, Petrie. Petrie, not sure. Little for try? Oh, no. Not me, Petrie. Hmm? Four-footers like us can't get our feet that close together when we run. But it sure is fun to watch. Okay, here goes nothing. <laughs> that was fun, while it lasted. It doesn't look that hard. <laughs> See? It's easy. <laughs> Petrie, your turn! Petrie, not sure about this. Me not good runner like Chomper, me flyer. Well then, if you start to fall, you can always fly off the log, Petrie. Oh yeah, me can fly. Uh, okay, me try. You <laughs> Up. Guess it's not so easy after all. We just need to practice until practice isn't practice anymore. Yeah, we could get as good as Ducky or even better. Chomper, you are not better than me at log running. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, why don't you practice? Then when we're all ready, we can have a game to see who can log run the longest. <laughs> This is going to be a fun game, especially when I win! Don't count your hatchlings before they hatch, Chomper. Me agree, because me going to win. Oh, no, no, no! I will win! Once I can get back on my log. Hi, guys! What game is this? The Great Log Running Game. Chomper, Ruby, Peachy, and Dickie are going to see who can stay on their log the longest. Look at them go! That's a game for two-footers, not four-footers like us. Whoa! whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> this log running doesn't look so hard to me. Huh? Mm -hmm. Three horns can do anything better than any one, two-footer or four. That's a fact. Just watch. <gasps> Step aside, two-footers. Let me show you how a real champion does it. Spike. See you back at the watering place. 
Okay, tell me. Why are you limping? I slipped off a log. No big deal. Oh, yes, it is. Your ankle is all swollen up. Here, these will ease the pain. Trisha, you bring some nice soothing mud and put it on the hurt. <laughs> don't bother with the mud. I've got to get back to practice log running. I don't think so. You'll be okay, but you need to stay off that ankle for a while, Sarah. Go get something done, Sarah. <laughs> for a mud bath. <laughs> this is really fun! <laughs> sure is! Me want to have fun, too. Somebody hurry up and fall! Hmm. We need another log, Petrie. Come on, Spike. What do you think, Spike? Can you knock one down? <laughs> wow, you make it look so easy. <sighs> okay, let's go. Petrie. Thanks, guys. You and Spike should give it a try, Little Foot. It's really fun. Oh, no, not us. You saw what happened to Sarah. <laughs> well, feels pretty good. Thanks for helping. Are you sure your ankle is okay? I'm sure. Time to go win that log running game. It'll be so easy. If it's so easy, how did you hurt your ankle? Accidents happen, but I can handle it. I'm a three horn. That's what I'm afraid of. What are you afraid of? Oh, nothing, Topsy. It's just Sarah twisted her ankle at the watering place, but she says it's okay now. Of course it's okay. <laughs> Takes more than a bad ankle to keep a good tree horn down. That's right, Tria. I'm feeling fine. Ready to go back and tackle my log again. I want to win that game. Log? Game? What's all this? My friends are playing a log running game, Dad, and I'm going to win. Well, just what exactly is log running? Well, you get on the log in the water, and then you start running, and the log spins as you run. It's easy. Why would you want to do something silly like that? To prove that three horns can do anything they set their mind to, and be the best at it. Remember? Just like you said, Dad. Well, uh, uh, of course three horns can do anything they set their mind to. Uh, uh, they, they just don't set their mind to things like log running. But, Dad, you didn't say anything about that. You said three horns could do anything. Yes, just not that. You can forget about playing that game, Sarah. Some things just aren't meant to be.
there's only one thing to do. I gotta prove to everyone that I can win that log running game. Okay, everybody. Let's start the great log running game. On your mark. Get set. Go! Huh? Oh, dear. <gasps> what? <laughs> Ducky, Ruby, and Chomper have gotten really good. This game might take a while. <laughs> Hold it! Stop the game! Whoa! Uh, uh, oh. Oh. I am the only one still going. <gasps> Do I win? Yes, Ducky, you... Not so fast. You guys started without me, but the game doesn't count unless I'm playing, too. But, Sarah, what about your ankle? You should My ankle is fine. Where's my log? Uh... Never mind, I'll get my own. Ducky not win? Well, sort of, but not really. I do not care. It is just a game. <gasps> Just a game. I'll show them. Three horns can do anything they said. They're mine, too. So why can't I get on top of this dumb log? Whoa! Watch out, Sarah! You're getting too close to the fast water! I can handle it! I'm a three-horn! Uh-oh. We have to stop her, or she'll end up going over Roaring Falls! Ruby, Chomper, Ducky, use your logs to try to catch up with Sarah! Right! Let's get moving and go! Be careful! We don't want to have to save you, too! Fast water log runners to the rescue! Littlefoot, need help, too! Okay, Petrie, you keep an eye on Sarah from the sky. Tria, have you seen Sarah? No, dear. Hmm. Well, I'm going to go look for her. If she's gone to the watering place to play that silly game after I told her not to, why, I'll... I know, I know. You're going to be very upset. Remember, Topsy, you were young once, too. I was? Huh. That's where I'm going. That rock could block the fast water and, and stop Sarah from going over the falls. But Mr. Threehorn, it's so big, no one can move it. A Threehorn can if he sets his mind to it. Now watch me. Let us help! Okay, 
Okay, boys. All together now. Harry! She almost here! I disobeyed you, Dad. You better be. I'm so glad that you're all right. We did not finish our game, Sarah. Do you still want to play? No, thank you. <laughs> I think Sarah's learned her lesson. Lesson? Huh. I don't have anything to prove. After all, I stayed on my log all the way down the fast water. <laughs> I meant to do that. <laughs> thought I'd see him again. There was all sorts of trouble the last time he was here. <laughs> well, I hope he doesn't bring any bad luck with him this time. <clears throat> Good game, guys! Yeah, next time Spike's on our team. <laughs> <laughs> I do not think so. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> guys! Guys! <laughs> He's coming back! Who's coming back? Where have you guys been? Doc's coming back! Doc? Mm -hmm. You mean the lone dinosaur? All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Running bright with a newborn sun. Come follow me. Used to climb in the valleys to roam. Old streams to follow our way home. To the land before time. Before time. wasn't that long ago. Everyone thought the Great Valley's good luck had run out because Saurus Rock had been damaged. I tried to bring our luck back by taking a tooth from a dead sharp tooth. The only problem was the sharp tooth wasn't dead. tried to save me. But he had to fight two shark teeth. That's when Doc showed up. anyone again. Thanks to Grandpa and Doc, the Lone Dinosaur. How exciting! Now I know why everyone's so excited. So where did the Lone Dinosaur go? Where's he been? He never stay in one place very long. And he is always alone. He is, he is. Well, yeah. 
That's why he's the lone dinosaur. But wherever there's trouble with sharp teeth, he'll be there. You said trouble, right? Yep. He always seems to know when sharp teeth are coming here. Uh, you don't think... Don't worry, Chomper. I think he'd understand about you. I don't know. Mm. How is Doc supposed to know Chomper's different? I'll tell him. Doc doesn't seem like the kind of long neck who likes to be told. He's after me, isn't he? Of course not. Could be. He'd never pick on a kid. But he'd always pick on a sharp tooth. Whatever's going to happen won't happen until it does. So let's all just get a good night's sleep so we're all well rested. Okay. You're right, Ruby. Good night, everyone. Good, good night, night, everybody. Don't worry, it'll be okay. If Doc's as good as they think, I'm sure he'll think you're good too. Huh? <sighs> Don't worry, it'll be okay. Don't worry, it'll be okay. Scary, Chomper, but it was a sleep story, and now you're awake, so you shouldn't worry. Unless you fall asleep again. Or unless he's really coming after me. <gasps> Hi, everybody. Chomper had a scary sleep story that the lone dinosaur was coming to get him. So did I. Really? Was he trying to crush you with his tail? Um, no. He was trying to crush you. <gasps> huh? He's coming! He's coming for me! <gasps> Could be. No, he's not, Sarah. He only come for sharp teeth in past. See? So what do you want to do? Try to hide Chomper until Doc's gone? That's a great idea! Then that's what we should do. Okay. I'll try to distract Doc while you guys hide Chomper. So Doc's big enough that I'd see him coming, right? Oh, yes. <laughs> he is very, very big.
kid. How have you been? Great! Watch, I've learned to whip my tail just like you! <laughs> you, uh, might want to work on that a little more. I will. Maybe you can teach me more tricks while you're back. Sure, kid. By the way, have you seen a long neck named Dara around? No. Who's Dara? Well, she's my lady friend. Huh? Lady friend? Yep. She's the prettiest long neck these tired eyes have ever seen. I remember the first time I saw her. Her big blue eyes sparkled brighter than the big water itself. She understands my need to roam and has been my traveling partner for a while now. A lonely long neck couldn't ask for much more. But how can you have a partner? You're supposed to be out there alone. Well, I was for a long time. Right, and that's why you were able to keep an eye out for any sharp teeth causing trouble. Just the same, kid. You care to help me find Dara? She's a stranger to these here parts. Let's hope she hasn't run into any trouble. But, Doc, if you're busy spending time with Dara, how are you going to have time to protect all the other leaf eaters? <laughs> she said she'd meet me here. You can't be the lone dinosaur if you're not alone anymore. No sign of Dara. Best we keep looking. What are they doing? Uh, me think they're looking for something. He's coming for me. Aha! Uh -huh. I was right all along. will not let Doc hurt you. Oh, no, no, no. Littlefoot's probably too little to stop Doc. Right. That's why we better find a place to hide Chomper. I really don't think she's here. Maybe she decided not to come. Hmm. She said she'd meet me here. So unless there's a problem, that's just what she'll do. He's even bigger than he was in my scary sleep story. And that's why we have to hide you. Now, where would Doc not think to look for a small little sharp tooth? <gasps> of course! The rocks! Quick, everyone gather around Chomper and we'll all move together. Okay, everyone be very quiet. Chomper's life is depending on it. It is! Yes! Shh! Oops. What was that? Uh... Minor earth shake? Been through enough of those. Let's keep looking. Okay, what is it? Will 
Will we all fit? Oh, good thing me family not home today. Your good idea was really a good idea, Petrie. It was. It was. <laughs> Phew! I can finally calm down. We'll see. This way up high. Doc not find us here. Not find who where. <laughs> you found me. You are supposed to keep Doc away. I know, but you promised. I'm sorry, Chomper, but it's going to be okay. Doc's not looking for you. He's looking for his lady friend, Dara. Right, Doc? <sighs> Doc? I can't believe you're friends with a sharp tooth. What do you mean? I mean, there's no use being friends with him. You're just gonna have to fight him someday. No, I'm not. Chomper's my friend and always will be. Yeah! And I'll never fight my friends! Yeah, of course he wouldn't! Neat trick, teaching him to talk. Oh, he learned it all on his own. See? He is different. He is, he is. <sighs> Maybe I can even use my sniffer to help you find your friend. Hmm. That'll be the day. What will? The day I ever accept help from a sharp tooth. But I'm telling you, Chomper's different. I ain't never had a good experience with a sharp tooth, and I don't reckon I'll start having one now. Let's go, little foot. No. <laughs> I'm not helping you anymore. Have it your way, kid. You know, I still think I could use my sniffer to help. That would show, Doc. Me want to help? Oh, me too. <laughs> what do you say, little foot? Just because you won't help Doc doesn't mean you shouldn't help Dara. You're right, Ruby. Come on, Chomper. Let's go find Dara. <coughs> you can do it, Chomper. You can. You can. Ugh. Not with the nose full of mud. <coughs> This swamp is full of sneaky mud spots. I hope Doc's friend is okay. Me too. Then come on, we gotta find her. The smell's stronger this way. <laughs> She's gotta be here somewhere. But we've looked everywhere. Oh no! Look! Ugh. Help! Please! Ugh. Little ones, please, you must find my friend Doc to help me get out. Dara! You know me? But how? Ugh. We'll never find Doc in time. We have to get you out of there now. But Dara too big, how we help her? Uh, there! We can use that tree to pull her out. All we have to do is bend it down to her. Great idea. We're coming, Dara. Ugh. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're 
a little sharp tooth. It, it, it's true, but I just want to help. Try to grab the tree so we can get you out. A cute, helpful sharp tooth. Why, as I live and breathe. I can't reach her. Everyone, slide forward a little. No, kids! <laughs> what are we going to do now? We don't do anything. Look! Why you were late? Uh. And Chopper here, why, he risked his little life to save me. <laughs> I know. I'm sorry. What for? I was the one who was wrong, kid. You are different. I hope you can find it in you to give an old long neck another chance. Well, sure. Thanks, Doc. So, Doc, why were you and Dara coming to the Great Valley? Well, I don't really have any kin of my own, so I wanted Dara to meet Littlefoot and his grandma and grandpa. Which reminds me, where is Littlefoot? Over there. Excuse me. Feel like talking? Sure. I'm sorry I said all those things before. It was disrespectful. It was the right thing to do, kid. Huh? No one's ever really told me when I was wrong before, Littlefoot. Do you promise to keep doing it? Um, sure, Doc. Then we're good. Let's join the rest, and I'll show you how to really do that tail whip. I feel so happy. I want everyone to see. It's like the bright circle is shining inside of me. When Doc came back, You taught me your friend, the sharp tooth stiff friend. And I'm so glad that we can be friends. I feel so happy, I want everyone to see. It's like the bright circle is shining inside of me. I feel so happy, I want everyone to see. It's like the bright circle is shining inside of me. Sounds like hip. 
Oh, me go now. Me no like him. No, Petri. This way. Hey, wait for me. Hey, guys, who's Hip? And why are we running from him? Hip and his friends Mutt and Nod are the biggest troublemakers in the Great Valley. They can sometimes be very mean. They can, they can. They're in here somewhere. I hear them. I have found a way out. I have. Be careful. You do not want to step on any of the eggs. Eggs? What eggs? All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Come follow me. Yes, the time and place to go. Uh, guys, those aren't just eggs. They're fast spider eggs. Fast spiders? They're sharp tooth eggs? Smash them! You can't do that! Don't touch no, them! No, no, no! We found the eggs, so we get to decide what to do with them. <laughs> what makes you think that what's in those eggs won't no. eat you? They haven't hatched yet. But we can't let sharp teeth eggs hatch near the Great Valley. It's too dangerous. Then let's move them as far from the Great Valley as we can. But we cannot take the eggs away from their mommy. No, no, no. What if eggs' mommy come looking for them? I know. We can get the fast spider mom to run after Petrie here, then the rest of us will scram. <laughs> <laughs> That is a very mean idea, Hip. It is. It is. What? He can fly, can he? Wait. Hip might be onto something. Oh, no. I am? Listen. A mom would always follow her eggs, right? So we can use the eggs to lure the mom away from the Great Valley. Make sharp tooth chases? On purpose? You gotta be crazy! <laughs> <laughs> you said it, Hip! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, crazy! <laughs> <laughs> that sharp tooth mom's gonna chase you wherever you take those eggs! That's the idea. Sounds like a bad idea to me. But you guys have fun! <laughs> if we're gonna move these eggs, we need everyone's help. If you do not help, these sharp teeth could hurt someone in the Great Valley. Maybe even you. Do you really want to take that chance? Ah, uh, where's my egg? We need to hide the eggs in a place just like this. There's a cave in that big mountain that should work. Okay, we'll take the eggs there. But that's really far away. That is probably a good thing. It <laughs> moved! Is the egg hatching now? Not yet, but we don't have much time before they do. Shush, shush, shush. It's probably the mom coming for her eggs. She sounds like she's really close. Then we better get going. Come on. She 
was close. Is that her? Is that the egg's mom? That's the mom, all right. And she wants her eggs back. Okay. Hip and I will distract her. The rest of you, head for the lake past the trees. We'll meet there. Bah, 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 bah. Come on, Hip, let's go. Hey, over here. Look what we've got. Go, run for the trees. To look back, follow me, and do not let go of the eggs. It would be very, very bad if they break. Well, I'm not sure this idea's a good one. What if that fast spider mom were to catch us? Why don't we leave the eggs right here and run? We are too close to home to leave them here. If they should have Scared? You scared, Mud? Well, maybe. I mean, no, I'm not scared. Right. Then let's move these eggs. I hope Littlefoot and Hip are okay. Great idea. We're trapped. Now what are we gonna do? I'll think of something. Yeah, just like you thought we should run down this canyon. Be quiet, Hip. I need to think. Here's a thought. We dump the egg and get out of here. We're not leaving the egg. Oh, yeah? Distracted her. Now's my chance. Stay away! No! Stay away!
What that? You made it! You did! You did! It just took a little teamwork. That's all. Well, we better keep this team moving. If we break into three groups, she'll have a harder time following us. It's someone else's turn to be sharp tooth bait. I'm through. Head for the canyon, past the gray meadow. Uh, you guys can lure the sharp tooth next. Good idea. We will see you at the canyon. Good luck, Chomper. Don't worry, little foot. We'll be okay. I know how sharp teeth think. It'll be fastest if we go straight across the water. Ready, Mutt? Oh. <laughs> It'll be okay. We just need something for the egg to float on. Uh, uh, we'll need something for me to float on, too. What do you mean? I'm, uh, not a very good swimmer. That's okay. I'm not the best swimmer either. Now, let's see. That should work. If you hold on to the edge and kick, you'll be okay. Like me, see? Hey, Chomper! Wait for me! I'm coming! <laughs> Oh no! The egg! I, I got it! Good job, partner! Yeah! <laughs> Good job! <laughs> Woo! We made it! Now we have to make sure the fast fighter mom follows us! Maybe she can't swim either. I'll get her attention. move sharp tooth eggs it's crazy it's the right thing to do and it's helping the great valley ha we wouldn't be in this mess if you'd have listened to me instead of that sharp tooth why would i listen to you chomper might be a sharp tooth but he's my friend uh little foot and he's a lot nicer than you all you ever think about is what you want to do little foot the egg huh She's right behind us! 
She coming, she coming! Wait for us! <laughs> We're trapped! <laughs> on each other's backs, Chopper and I can hand the eggs up to Ducky. Couldn't carry this egg alone, could I? We're almost there. The cave I was talking about should be right across this meadow. Oh, not her again! <laughs> She never gives up! Oh, she loves her eggs. She does. Enough she does. talking. Run! This is it. Over here, everyone. She won't see us here. in there. And they don't look that scary. <laughs> Most babies don't. Uh... <laughs> now they have their mommy. They do, they do. Maybe we did do the right thing. Yep. And now no one in the Great Valley has to worry about them. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. We went adventuring and moved those shark tooth eggs. To see them hatch was such a treat. Who would have thought they look so sweet? Just remember what they eat. Come on, let's go. We did what we set out to do. Went adventure. 
Sure. And to think, you guys wanted to just get rid of them. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> 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 